Can we start it like that? No. Why not? Yeah. Hey, all you cool cats and kittens. <laughs> hey, Vogue, it's Baby Rexa, and this is my perfect night in all by myself. This is like, honestly, this is all I do all day is feed bear. Okay, over here is a very special drawer. Bears, outfits, a leather jacket for when she's feeling like a badass, coat, her sweater. Of course, these incredible mosquito outfits right here. Look at that, her sombrero. This, this is her favorite toy. Let's see if she comes. Bear, come here! Quarantine's, you know, been, you know, up and down, but you know, there's tough days and then there's fun days that I get to spend with my brother and my dog. Flo, come on, let's see you, get over here. This is my quarantine buddy. Hey guys. He's been helping me clean and do the laundry and wash the floors and... Try to eat healthy and go running every day. That's not true. Bear, tell us what room you're in. We're in the black room, you guys. We're gonna show you some cool things that I really love. This is my first VMA, and it was for Call Me Mine with the Chainsmokers. I really love it. I have Meant to Be, I have my Disney Awards, which are really cool. But let me show you something that I really, really love. I think this is the top of the snare head. It has my playlist of the songs that I did, which were The Monster, Pray, I'm Gonna Show You Crazy, I Don't Wanna Grow, Hey Mama at the time, Take Me Home, and I Can't Stop Drinking About You. I won Sexiest Songstress. Ooh, sorry. So this is a helmet that I got at the Indy 500 when I sang um, the Star Spangled Banner and it's like a legit helmet and it, look at that, and it has like um, crystal on it and stuff and when you actually put this on, it's like really, I'm not going to put it on right now, it's really snug and it's like, ooh. look at my hair now. So we're in my sitting area. I'm with Bear. She's in her cute little outfit. I really, really love eyewear. It's like so fun to me because I feel like you can dress up any outfit. Look how sick those are. The paparazzi glasses. They're called the backup glasses. They cover half of my face and it's like, ooh. I feel like these are great skiing glasses. Elton John sunglasses, like an Elton John moment. Oh, and then I have a pair of I wanna be cool hipster Instagram flame glasses. Flo and I are making this dish, it's called a uh, grosh. It's an Albanian dish and um, my mom used to do for us when we were little. So we're about to finish off our grosh. We got the beans right here going. Yeah, he's better at making this than me. So he's gonna take control. I'm just gonna look pretty and stand here. I can cook things really well, but I'm not great at cutting. For me, it's like I just use the whole rustic excuse. And we're just gonna saute this. It's an easy Albanian dish to make. I try my best to write lists down or do little things here and there to have somewhat of a structure. Today I'm going to give Bear a bath and call this person, this person, and this person, and I put it in a list. A lot of my days have been consisting of organizing stuff and cleaning and then sleeping and then getting back up and trying to finish what I started. I love band tees because I feel like it brings me closer to the artists and the period that they were making their music. This t-shirt is probably one of my favorite vintage tees. I go around looking for these t-shirts or sometimes they'll just find me. Madonna's, who's that girl world tour? It was her 1987 tour, I wasn't born yet. Growing up at home, my mom used to play a lot of Madonna and she's such a badass. I grew up in Staten Island and at the time, they were selling this t-shirt, which is super rare. It says, please stop the violence. And it was after they both had passed away. It's crazy because as messed up as this might sound, I also find that being locked down in quarantine has made me closer to my family. I told my family, I was like, I want a, a Sunday call on Zoom with all 15 of us every Sunday. And I don't want it to stop. Okay, okay yeah, it's like a night in for us every single night adding cucumbers in, I have tomatoes, I have a little bit of avocado in there. We're gonna just add some salt, paprika, garlic powder to the onions. Show the onions, they look really good right now. We're gonna add some paprika. We kind of go a little crazy on this. This is what it's all about though. Look at that. We had pepper plants, cucumber plants, growing up in our yard in Staten Island in New York City. And every summer we would make fresh tomato, onion, pepper salad. 
and we'd add some feta cheese on top. So good. And we're gonna just pour this into the mixture. It's so hard to explain. Like the, the taste. taste is unbelievable, and now people are gonna steal it yeah. or screw. It. These are not normal times, but we can't allow ourselves to fall down the dark hole of like what ifs, what's, you know what I mean? So this will, I think, give us perspective to be more grateful, like to go outside and to see friends. And it, I can't believe how much I took that for granted. We kind of feel like our lives are at halt. Like, what do we do? And I think that this is a time where we can be compassionate with ourselves and just say, you know what? It's okay. We can do little things here and there to better ourselves, but we should be nice to ourselves. All right, so we finished cooking and I'm gonna take you outside to where we're gonna have our meal. Here's the food that we made. Can you see it? We got the salad, the grosh, got some bread. It's gonna be delicious. We gotta do the dip, the Albanian dip. <laughs> mm. Bread. Mm. Bread makes it. Hey, it's Bibi Rexa. To watch more Vogue videos, subscribe here. I have to do this one because, duh, me, myself, and I, by me and Jeezy. Ooh, it's just me, myself, and I, duh. Oh no, I like, locked up, they won't let me out. They won't let me out.